Hi everyone, today it's time we learn about ground transportation. Here's a bike. It has two wheels and we can move it by using these pedals. You can ride around the city with it or bike up a mountain. Here's a motorbike. It also has two wheels, but they are powered by a motor. A motorbike will whiz you around the city much faster. Don't forget to wear a helmet. This is a car. It's one of the most popular. It has four wheels and can fit your family. Let's go for a drive. Here's a van. It's similar to the car, but the trunk is much bigger. You can fill it up with things. This is a bus. Once you get on, the driver will take you and up to 50 more passengers. Let's go. This is a truck. It's used to take merchandise from one place to another. Let the adventure begin. Here's a train. It's pulled by a locomotive and connected with wagons. It needs tracks to ride on and pick up speed. It can go really fast. Let's review what we have just learned. Bike. Motorbike. Car. Van. Bus. Truck. Train. Great! Hi everyone! Today it's time we learn about water transportation. A boat is mostly used in shallow water. A ship is bigger. It is used in wide rivers and seas. It can transport people or goods. The person in charge is the captain. Motorboats are small and are mostly pumped with air. They have a small motor and are quite light. They can be used in rescues. Canoes are long and can fit very few people. You can move it along using the paddles. Careful, don't fall off. Sailboats are boats that move thanks to the wind in their sails. Pirates used to travel in these. Fun, this is jet ski. It's used to move very fast around the coast. It fits one or two people. What about deeper down in the sea? We have submarines. It can travel underwater for months. This is a cruise ship. They're the biggest boats on the planet. They can travel very long distances. They usually transport goods and people. Let's review what we have learned. Boat. Ship. Motorboat. Canoe. Sailboat. Jet ski. Submarine. Cruise ship. Nicely done, sailor. Hi everyone. Today it's time we learn about air transportation. This is a plane. It's really big and has been designed to travel long distances. We could go from London to Hong Kong and have a trip around the world. This is a small plane. It can only fit a small number of people. It can fly lower and closer to the ground. Here's a helicopter. It is able to fly thanks to its big propeller. It is placed just on top of the cabin. We use it when we need to rescue someone or when we want to move very fast from one place to another. This is a hot air balloon. It uses a gas that helps it fly. The passengers will travel in the basket. And last but not least is the rocket. These are designed to fly outside the Earth's atmosphere. Astronauts use them to go to the moon. They go super fast. Let's review what we have just learned. 
plane! Small plane! Helicopter! Hot air balloon! Rocket! Great! Which was your favorite transport? You can write it below on the comments. Oh, and if you wish to watch more videos, subscribe to the Smile and Learn channel by clicking on the seal.